Ah, oh, it's always good for another scary siren Friday. Don't look at me, okay? Number one, broken tooth. I s I'm still waiting for this to get fixed. Number two, my hair is messy. Deal with it. I don't know if you, if you can even hear me through this. I have to talk loud, unfortunately. But hello, everybody. My name is Tyler Prime, and let me just. And welcome back to yet another scary siren Fridays. <laughs> I look forward to these every week. And I last week would have been the best, my, my favorite ones I would have done, okay? Would have been my favorite ones because it would have been Siren Head vs. Thunder Man, Coraline vs. Alice in Wonderland, and... Marble Hornets, but no, I had to get ruined and I had to get sick. Lovely. So now uh, we're going to be doing three or maybe two different things. Marble Hornets still happening. Today we're going to be reacting to Coraline or Alice in Wonderland versus Coraline from Freshly Canal. Um, this is a rap battle. If you don't like those, you can get out, but. Without further ado, let's react to this, shall we? Coraline scared the shit out of me when I was younger. That's all I can say. Okay, Alice, that Tim Burton sh version should not be PG-13. That crap should be rated R. But anyways... Here's a few pointers. You bit off your design and storyline like a walrus chomping on oysters. So let me break off on this little pathetic hot topic dresser. It's been more faster than hands. He walked into director. I'm sailing on the ocean. We're not sitting in the same boat. We all know what happens to kiddies in their own raincoat. And we have a cameo from Pennywise, everyone. This week's Scary Siren Fridays has gotten a Pennywise cameo. Give it an applause. We all know how we like Pennywise on this channel. Give it an applause. Sing up a look and you're far out of the picture. Doing it just like your parents recognize and ditch you. But it's no wonder as you land next to the ghost kid. How ironic you made everybody's heart stop motion. Ew, what a messy attitude. Something I normally wouldn't want to confront. But when Coraline is at the core of a line, I double up the pun just to let me tell you I couldn't find a. Did you just say I couldn't find a soul who's invested in her movies? Hey, Mom. Coraline said no one is invested in Alice in Wonderland, so I thought of you. Video. <laughs> Uh, actually, Coraline, she's been around since 2010, 2011, 20, 2010, and she came back for a sequel in 2016. So that bar doesn't really, really work for her. Oh, jeez. you can never ever size up. Like, even if you think your brand would continue to grow, it looks like you totally must have gone mad. Alice in Wonderland syndrome. Cause you're reboot. 
First Peter Pan syndrome, now this. I. Don't go that far, else in the land of broken hearts. Run from your hallucinations, but no dream could heal these scars. I give it to Coraline. Two reasons. One, her bars and disses were really good. Except for that one diss. Because that one diss about Alice not being around since the 50s was kind of wrong on that one. Um, but other than that, I prefer her over Alice. As much as I like Alice in Wonderland. Coraline scared the hell out of me when I was younger, okay? I'm not joking when I'm, I'm telling you that. Tim Burton, I think that's who produced um, Coraline. He scared the living hell out of me with that movie. And my mother. So there's that. <sighs> Anyways, who do you think won? Was it Coraline or was it Alice from Alice in Wonderland? You can tell me if you like. Um, I applaud this dude. I'm glad he's getting uh, enough money to be able to like make mouths move make eyes blink in that it's a really nice touch and i'm glad he's starting to do that now and i was getting worried that he was going to stop doing the cartoon stuff because his cartoon stuff is what makes his channel unique compared to the other ones his live action battles are good but i think every rap battle channel has their own unique style of rap battles Video game rap battles have video game. ERB has epic history. And Freshly Canal has as cartoon like styles. Which is good. So, anyways, this has been Tyler Prime, and I will see you guys in the next Scary Siren Friday episode with this. Bye bye.